say the transition to D1 has been rocky for WKU could be described as a huge understatement. But taking it to the Sun Belt Conference and winning seven of eight has the pulse of Topper Nation at anything but a flat line. This year, definitely, we've made a, a huge improvement. Having Coach Taggart here has been rather huge. Um, I think I, we can attribute a lot of the turnaround to um, his coaching style. Well, they were definitely a joke. Well, they were the joke. They definitely came up and showed us what they're about. Well, I think Bobby Rainey, obviously, is one of the best stories in college football. Having other players develop over the season has really improved their uh, their ability to pass the ball and get the ball downfield and score. Well, I feel like they're, they've gone from overrated to underrated. Regardless of national reputation, the fans here at Western are energized for a new beginning and now have a reason to show up in full force. Although economics were to blame for the Hilltoppers missing out on their first postseason in quite some time, head coach Willie Taggart says that his team will have a chip on their shoulders come 2012 and will be ready to compete in the Sun Belt Conference. It's going to be a huge uh, lift in their spirits and morale to keep improving like they did this season. Change the attitude of this team completely. They believe they're winners. They're just inspired to do better and work harder and make it to another bowl next year. I think they're going to take it game by game because that's what good football teams do in the Hilltoppers. Next year, they're going to be a good football team. Reporting for the Extra Point, I'm Ryan Abney for News Channel 12.